was such bad air in the train. Ugh. <laughs> Use up air. Now I don't have to steal toilet paper because I got a roll from the toilet you've been at with me. <laughs> Book wasn't too bad. Apart from the talk about narcissist, narcissists, whatever. I need to keep this camera rolling because these morons right here tend to uh, whatever be morons. See for five minutes if we find a ten even if we find some book to read or go through. Huh? Looks I know this one Gomora. It mentions a Oscar's dress or something or Met Gala by Angelina Jolie. And I'm not really trusting the story. I really don't. Well, Henning Mankell, I've heard quite a bit about, but I'm not sure. You know, I don't want to dwell in um, you know fantasy or whatever. I need facts. Or, uh, but now we need just one book, so let's. Ah. Let's look at this one. Let's analyze it. And it won't work, you know, whenever I try this one, it doesn't work. as if though they make the door to stay closed. Now again, it's this stupid radio we have to listen to, you know. So the book wasn't too bad. It was mentioning Onision that seems to have done a video, I'm a banana, <laughs> uh, which sounds kind of funny. And yeah, I've watched two or three videos, but I'm not into him. But they say in the book, the guy says that the, guy, the people, uh, you know, the flaws. So like when they say Kardashian, Kim, she's being herself. Well, that one isn't quite true, you know. She's a brand, so, but the flaws, that's kind of true. So she seems to have been posting a picture of herself showing all the contouring cream that they put on her face. So that picture was liked a lot. Yeah. So let's go through this one. Somebody has been painting into it. You know, if life is as simple as this tupper wear thing, you just get plastic bottles and then your whole life, woo, you know, kind of turns into uh, a uh, real nice experience like this, you know. <laughs> but it's all plastic, you know. That's what I don't like about it. No. And you even can put it into the oven and the refrigerator. That's kind of what's funny about it. 
and you know you need, we, we do eat so all the plastic so here for the sauce probably <laughs> I don't know what's the plastic on here I don't see it uh, so it's a cookbook I mean come on if you got your food in a plastic ball like this don't you feel like a chicken don't you feel like I saw a dog today and the owner of the dog was not really looking at the dog and to me it felt like the dog was being left out from the conversation and also he was freezing he was always sitting on the floor but then he kind of you know was shaking his body was shaking and he had no fur and there was wind so maybe she should put on some you know that dog maybe stems from warmer regions i mean if you have food in a bowl like this don't you feel like i mean dogs eat from balls i'm sure or they take it from the floor like my cats do i just put it onto the bare stones on the ground but if you have a ball like this don't you feel like a chicken <laughs> you know food looks better in on a plate like this rather than in a ball that looks kind of plastic I mean that is plastic because it is plastic it looks like plastic Ooh. I mean come on the color is thrilling of course but it's plastic glass mm. you know when you have the same food in a glass jar you want to have it but when it's in this plastic thing you go like hmm you know maybe they have kind of not cleaned the the kitchen well enough you know it looks kind of cheap Glass would look so nice, whatever this is. Oh, it's from Finland something. <laughs> yeah, it's pastry something. Yeah. And you can see the mind bending they're doing. Like they have these flags and they have the... I mean, come on. When you have a dish like this and then you drink from a plastic glass. You cannot say so, but like come on it feels so cheap it feels so children safe you know when you have a children venue and the children need to have like well they don't need to but they often put plastic stuff for children when they are small because they're gonna s throw it onto the floor a lot and stuff so that one seems to be plastic too when they put it into the oven yeah so there we go it's all the same color Ooh, broken yeah and it's got a lid as well so oh what a world you know but it's about the party like when someone visits you with all these Tupperware things then you go like oh now I got some communication going on and then when even more people sit regularly and look at the new products you kind of go yeah maybe buy this or that so you talk in each other into buying stuff <laughs> that's the truth and then also it feels like you know something vivid just because the, the people were around and you were uh, communicating so I was reading in that book I just gone through that the frontal lobe does uh, the romantic love and also hate is steered there. So when people hate on your page, you should embrace it because the haters are going to be fought by your fans and by that you build a strong fan base. And also they got something to do, right? I may add. Uh. I mean, come on. If you have, uh, we've been there. But if you have a table 
and then your sauce is coming from these things we just saw. Where are they? I think we passed them. No. Uh. Here. Oh. Would you want to sit on a table and then there is this, whenever I see these plastic things, I'm kind of, uh, is there a baby around? Is there a kid around? You know, if I had a kid or a baby, I'd use glass and ceramic jars and all of that, heavy things, so the fingers, the hand of the child gets trained. I've seen that. So a woman that was bringing up a little girl wasn't handing out these things to the girl so the girl was not constantly um, touching plastic and also the heavy jars you might find one in here she drank from she even hold, was holding them themselves ceramic jars they looked like these um, you know farmers uh, jars like this but small to drink from like we had milk and tea with those and then when we wanted to drink water we had glasses small glasses but the, the cups the mugs without a handle that were like maybe half the size like this they don't have one in here they were kind of heavy. Yeah. So now we went through two books. Yeah. At least what you can say is that when you put food into these plastic things, it gets cold pretty quick. Lee, because plastic cannot store heat. So by that, uh, you can eat it right away. But it will pick up the plastic. There was this uh, mm, oh, a bit like this. The mugs were. There was a Scandinavian couple, and they weren't touching plastics for like two weeks. And within their system, a doctor could already uh, measure that their plastic count. So if you want, has gone back. Nice, huh? Oh. Yeah. So if I want to my ticket doesn't allow me to go the, the same way again, but I will go and get one of these tickets tomorrow and then uh, go to visit the monk. I will do that tomorrow. So bye bye.